from Local 24 Sports. It's the Mid-South's most complete coverage of high school football. This is Local Prep Live, powered by Sonic. Hi, how are you? Doc Holliday. Welcome to the first edition of Local Prep Live for the year 2018, week one of the high school football season, bringing us plenty of good matchups. So let's go. We start this show at Briarcrest, where the White Station Spartans trying to march down on the Saints. Early on, White Station mistake. Fumbles to snap. Big dog. Briarcrest, Omari Thomas picks it up, and big dog goes the other way. 43-yard touchdown. Saints go up. Seven. Nada. But the Spartans have an answer. Jalen Cave scores on the short touchdown run. Ties it up at seven. Peace. But Jackson Walker for Briarcrest, great name, great game. Looking for someone to pass to, can't find anyone, so he scrambles. 25 yards later, he's in the painted points. Briarcrest up 14-7, and they cruise. They win this game 23-14. to FACS opening the season at home against the Devils. The Red Devils from Douglas. FACS, easy night for them tonight. Sack before the cold Putnam keeps it himself. He's smooth. Touchdown run, FACS up 33 to nothing. Third quarter, they want more points. Side 33, want a little bit more. This time, Daryl Pittman Jr. gets it. Nice cut. My man is, he's quick. And he's nice. 43 yards later, makes it 40 nothing. FACS, FACS goes on to win in a blowout. 47 to 6. The Cordova Wolves and their first-year head coach, Marcus Wimley, coming over from East, starting their season at home against South Haven. South Haven coming out, getting on the board. Jay Hill, one-yard TD keeper charges go up 7-0 in the first. But Cordova has an answer. Austin Wiley to Deion Hamer, and Hamer is on that sideline. Hang on, okay. Track me. That's a touchdown, but South Haven still up 7-6 in the first. But South Haven wanted a little bit more points. The charges help it again. This time he's looking... But Dale, but Ray, Ray, hauls it in, makes it 14-6. But how about this? Wembley and Cordova comes back to win this ball game, 21 to 14. At St. Benedict's, Kingsbury flying into Cordova on St. Benedict's campus, trying to get a win, but one gonna happen. St. Benedict wide receiver Jalen Powell around the corner, four-yard touchdown. Eagles up 27-7 in the third. But Kingsbury got, it got, got a nice little answer to Reyes Dyer. He gets the Eagles. In the points, painted points. Eagles still up 27-13. Third quarter, St. Benedict comes right back. Western McAllister, Mick Alexander. Two-yard touchdown run. St. Benedict wins this ball game 34-19. Now, of course, we have crews everywhere tonight. Jessica Benson was somewhere, but now she's back here where? Jessica at a couple of spots. JB, what you got? Thanks, Doc. There were quite a few coaching shakeups in the area this offseason. One of them happening at St. George's, where a Memphis native and former NFL safety Andre Lott was promoted to head coach. Lott and the Griffins facing off against Center Hill to start their season, all tied at 21-21 in the second quarter. Here's Preston Newson from the Mustangs with the low-key one-yard score on the QB keep. But it should be known, he was tearing it up on the ground all over the place tonight. Mustangs up 28-21 to start the second half. This time, Newsom pitches it to Justin Buckingham. He has his own palace. It's the end zone. Extra point blocks. So center hill up 34-21. Griffin's offense was working, just not scoring. Spencer Smith to Isaac Smith to get a nice foot down there, but the drive would stall as the Mustangs go on to win this one, 42-28. Over in Collierville, hosting Olive Branch to start the season. Dragons coach Mike O'Neill making his return to the sidelines after beating cancer this offseason. Go coach O'Neill. Scoreless in the first. Conquistador senior QB Cole Caitlin. Bullet to the corner of the end zone. That's Hunter Riley right there as Olive Branch takes the early 7-0 lead up 7-3 later in the first. This guy was just waiting to bust out for a big run. Dakota Bruswell, surprise, surprise. Kid also runs track. Watch him go 72 yards to the house. Olive Branch holds on to win this one. 21-214. The Conquistadors looking to build on last year's 12-2 season that ended with a loss in the North Half title game. Looked good. Week one. Doc, back to you. Thank you, JV. The East Mustangs, you know, their head coach last year, women, he's over at Cordova. You saw them win their first game tonight, but the same thing wasn't going to happen for Katari Donald at East. Early on, they're taking on Kip at Melrose, Jalen Wright. Give me that. Kip said, you better come here, buddy. Later on, Bronson White gets a nice little 15-yard game, but East could not score on this drive. And when Kip got it, they did score right here. Decavius Tutson keeps it for a 
Nice little eight-yard gain, and then a little bit later, touch and call him King Tut. Goes up top to DJ Jones. 18-yard touchdown. Kip with a shut out tonight, winning 18 to nothing. Melrose, of course, not at home because we just saw them at home. Melrose at the home central, and their new coach, Major Wright. Melrose have major problems. That's the guy, central. Daryl Grayson with the major run, 15-yard tough run. Then a little bit later, Grayson says, hey, coach, all you got to do is give it back to me because if I run it down there, I'm going to finish. And he finishes, and this, they didn't want any parts of that. Walks in from 10 yards out, and Central wins this ball game in a route, 31 to 6. Raleigh eats up at Arlington football for the first time in 2018, and Arlington has some problems because they just came and just blowing out. Raleigh Egypt, that's Kenneth Walker for third touchdown. Then a little bit later, Kenneth Walker again for another touchdown easily. Then you know what? Kenneth Walker, the third. He's the third, so he, we've seen him score two touchdowns. He's the third, so how about he gets another touchdown? Nice little hard plant with the left. Arlington easily on this ball game. 56 to 18 is the final. Ed Barley, Wolverine, as in the Overton Wolverines. Ump campus in third quarter. Panthers go up top. Start the quarterback, Preston Reigns. Hits Demetrius Bell. Bell steps out of bounds. Didn't matter, though, because they finished it off like this. Reigns to Bell again. Easy touchdown in the corner, but then Bartlett. Air game goes to the run game. DJ Jones this time takes it in for the touchdown, and Bartlett rolls in this ball game, 63 to 22. Now, it's time for a quick timeout, but when time is back in, we head to the game of the week, Ridgeway at MUS. But first, we hear from the Collierville High School cheerleaders. Remember the good old days when you get a chili cheese coney and tot steel? Like this $2.99 American Classic we ordered ahead on the app? Yeah, like this American Classic we're having right now for $2.99. I just said that. Quit living in the past, man. Get the American Classic for just $2.99 and try order ahead to get happy hour anytime. It's simple. Since 1985, we've been supplying the Mid-South with Mercedes-Benz and other Highline imports handpicked by the owner, Andy Smith. Rates as low as 1.79% and warranties up to 7 years or 100,000 miles. Stress-free shopping with over 126 combined years of sales expertise to assist your purchase experience. We're at 2965 South 3rd Street or online at smithimports.com. Central Defense Staffing is having two gigantic job fairs to hire 200 staff people. The job fairs will be Saturday, August 18th from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. and again on Tuesday, August 21st, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. at Central Defense Staffing. Located at 7721 Hacks Crossroads, Suite 107 in Olive Branch. Jobs paying $11 per hour. Come early to avoid any wait time. Central Defense Staffing hiring immediately in Olive Branch, Mississippi. I relate to the berries in these real fruit berry shakes because they're small but powerful. I relate to the ice cream because it's rich and has an amazing singing voice. Got it. Oh. Get new real fruit berry shakes and download the app to try order ahead and get happy hour anytime. how new technology for Methodist University Hospital is helping. Plus, rain chances on the way out will let you know when with your full forecast. The journey I set out on 30 years ago rings loud in courts around the country every single day. For the people, not the powerful. And in our journey for justice, we've assembled an army of over 2,000 support staff and more than 400 lawyers in 50 offices nationwide. Sometimes in some of our more special cases. I handpicked the greatest investigator I know to join the team. Emma is for the people too. Morgan & Morgan. Does your small business internet provider promise a lot? Let's see who delivers more. Comcast Business gives you gig speed in more places. The others don't. We offer up to six hours of 4G wireless network backup. Everyone else? No way. We let calls from any of your devices come from your business number. Them? Not so much. We let you keep an eye on your business from anywhere. The others? Nope. Get 75 megabits per second internet for $49.95 per month for two years when you get two voice mobility lines. Call or go online today.
Thanks for coming back. Ridgeway and MUS making it a point to play each other the first game of the year nearly every year in this year. The same, always a huge matchup, huge math matchup this year. And you know what? It's our game of the week, and that's where we find Clayton Collier with our Family Leisure Game of the Week. What's up? Doc, there's a reason why these two teams have scheduled each other each of the last four years. It's not only a budding rivalry, but as you mentioned, MUS and Ridgeway's campuses are less than a mile apart. But aside from the geographic closeness, that's about where the similarities end for this game. Maurice Hampton is no stranger to the highlight reel, and he wasted no time getting on the board. Hampton, with the 25-yard grab, makes it look easy, makes it a 7-0 Owls lead. Now, this one had a shot at play of the week. Seller Shies lets it fly. Hampton there with the grab, stays on his feet, and he's taking this one all the way back to the house. But this one's coming back on a personal foul on MUS. But that wouldn't be his last look of the night. Five seconds before half, Owls on third and 10 shy fires it's Hampton again in the end zone and US takes a 17 to nothing lead into the locker room now Hampton was moved to safety this year because of the Owls depth at corner and it showed in the third senior corner to Kari Scott on the pick takes it back to the 30 Owls came up empty on the drive but it didn't matter they take the opener 34 to nothing And Maurice Hampton had four receptions for 80 yards along with those two touchdowns before he was pulled shortly after half. He had a 50-yard kick return as well before he was pulled in that second half. Also, his quarterback threw for 189 yards, three touchdowns, and Seller Shy ran for another of his own. That's going to do it from here for our Game of the Week at MUS. Doc, Jessica, back to you. Thanks, Clayton. Lausanne looking for a Shelby Metro record tying 28 straight win tonight. You know where Rose Ford didn't want to let them get it. Didn't matter, though, because Eric Gray said, we going to get it, and I'm going to get it, and I'm going to get gone. My man getting his sprinter on, 57-yard touchdown run. Lausanne rolling early and often. A little bit later, they say, you know what, Gray? Nope. He gets it again. Great, just rolled all kinds of yards tonight, 248 yards. Lausanne wins 47 to 14. Of course, they get their 28 straight win. Now, time out when time is back in. We wrap this thing up. But first, we hear from the Briar Crest. Bye. Local Memphis Live with Amy Sparopoulos. Weekday mornings at 9 on Local 24. It's a summer clearance sale going on now at Milano Menswear. Beautiful quality Milano suit, just $99. Buy one, get one free. Dress pants start at just $19. Buy one, get one free. Jeans, $19. Knits start at $19. Buy one, get one free. Sport shirts in all styles and sizes starting at $19. Buy one, get one free. Casual shoes, $39. Buy one, get one free. Selected Stacey Adams shoes. Buy one, get one free. It's a summer clearance sale going on now at Milano. Wolf J South Lamar in the new superstore in Riverdale. There's a lot to love at FFO Home. We just moved from a small apartment into our two-bedroom home. Other stores made our budgets feel small, but it was big at FFO. We filled four rooms for the price of one. FFO Home, where great quality furniture lives for less. It's FFO Home's back-to-school savings. Get a futon and frame, 146 Family sofa, only $3.98. Broyhill USB side tables, just $1.98. Enter to win a $500 room makeover. Now at FFO Home. Your mom said, comb your hair. Your dad told you, smart not. Your dog is judging you right now. And your best friend just called you crazy. We all need someone who'll pull no punches and give it to us straight. Now, imagine getting your news like that. No bull, no spin. Just give it to me straight. Straightforward news. Straight to the heart of the story. ABC News. Straightforward. There is only one job the royal family has. Survive. We have a new cast of characters. I did not have any understanding of what it would be like. The story of the royals starts Wednesday, 9, 8 central on ABC. The American Classic. A quarter pound double cheeseburger or chili cheese coney and tots for just $2.99. Mm -mm -mm. America. Hurry in for the $2.99 American Classic. And try order ahead to get happy hour anytime. Here's an actual case. Auto accident in Shelby County with severe injuries and large medical bills. 
defendant denies running red light, so NST files suit, takes several depositions, and hires experts. This case settled for policy limits of $2.1 million. All cases are different, but this is a real case with real results. Call Team NST at 683-7000. I relate to the berries in these real fruit berry shakes because they're small but powerful. I relate to the ice cream because it's rich and has an amazing singing voice. Got it. Oh. Get new real fruit berry shakes and download the app to try order ahead and get happy hour anytime. Of the weekend, that's Lausanne running back Eric Gray. Gray, 248 yards, three touchdowns on just 17 carries, and Lausanne's 47 14 win over Rose of Fort. Check this out the annual Whitehaven Classic taking place at Whitehaven at 3. Westwood taking on Hamilton tomorrow at 5 30. Mitchell knocking head to South, win, and then at 8. The neighborhood rivalry back on, fairly kicking off against Whitehaven. And next week, the CW30 Memphis High School Football Classic. Kicking off on CW 31st game, Cordova facing Southwind, and then at 8.30, Ridgeway taking on Whitehaven. That's going to do it for the first edition of Local Prep Live for the year 2018. For